Lewis, full time here. It's another win. The unbeaten run continues, and more importantly, we've equaled the club record of the first round, first round proper in the FA Cup. How did that feel? Yeah, no, really pleasing, really pleasing. It was one of those I kind of uh, had a feeling going into it what to what we was going to expect. Um, I, I, I thought they'd come here and they they had a game plan. I thought they caused us um, uh, some issues in terms of they made it difficult for us to break them down. Um, they were very resilient in the way they played. And sort of the message at half time was just keep moving the ball, keep being patient. Um, I thought we we were much better second half, um, and yeah, no, really pleased with, with uh, sort of the way way we played and and yeah to progress into the next round. Uh, and uh, as it seems to be every week at the moment, the goals are very much spread out. It's not down to just one person. I mean, it's showing that we've got a squad capable of anyone can score yeah it, yeah it does exactly that and and we've got bags of quality within the group and 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 that was proven today and and yes emma has been performing exceptionally well for us over over this season um but it also goes to show that um everyone can contribute everyone can get involved everyone can can uh can, can score goals and 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 what's really pleasing to see is like i said the amount of chances we are creating um and it's coming from different areas, whether it be the left side, whether it be the right side, through the middle. We're, we're creating opportunities and, and, and it's, it's really good to see. And um, we had a, a, another uh, positive today. We had uh, Tilly come back in between mm. the sticks, obviously Mill Millie's cup tied. So how do you think she, she got on? She didn't have too much to do, to be fair. No, she didn't. But what she did do, I thought she was excellent. And um, that's, that, that's, that's one of the hardest things as a goalkeeper. You can go the whole game where you don't have much to do and then you're called upon and, and I thought that, that, that save at the end, the 1v1 save, where she's put herself in a position where she probably knows she's going to get hurt. Um, she's very brave and, and, and no, I thought, I thought she was excellent and, and it was really pleasing to see that from her because she's had a bit of a tough start to the season. She had the injury in the, in the Luton game it, and it kind of set her back but, but no, her attitude's been great and yeah, really pleased for her. And finally, the question that you know I'm going to ask who do you want in the next round? Uh, anyone at home. Anyone at home. I think it's one of those, the way we're playing, um, I think w confidence is high. We just want a home, home tie. Okay, We can get numbers down. Um, yeah, we want to progress and, and make history. And when's the draw? I believe it's it's tomorrow. Um, I thought it was the same last time, but they didn't release it until the following day. But no, I, as far as I'm aware, it's tomorrow lunchtime. Okay, so we'll say Monday, Tuesday, worst yeah. case scenario. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, Finally, for me, next weekend, Dussie. Yep. What you? What do you expect on them? Um, if I'm if I'm being honest, we haven't come, we haven't crossed paths this season, so it's one that over this week we'll be really focusing on that. Um, all our attention went into today's game, um, so now it's a case of now today's done. We'll be looking at next week and making sure we're as uh, best prepared as we can be, so that we can yeah hopefully continue our run and pick up another three points. Lovely. Cheers, Lewis. Cheers, Jim.